Well, hello everyone. Uh, I gotta tell you guys what I made this week. I've created a surf rod method called Grinder, Coffee Grinder. Comes from South Africa. For the first time, surf fishermen in South Africa, who apparently has a lot more bigger surfs than we do, they came up with the idea of moving the reel to the left hand much closer to the bottom of the rod and that's what I did um, I had a piece of a rod that I adapted to a Daiwa surf caster tip so I made all of this handle myself together with a guide and the rubber and the real seat and the bottom and everything else you see so this rod now is 13 feet long and it's exactly what they describe as the grinder system rod where release mechanism which is this one introduced for the first time just a couple of years ago is going to release the line instead of using your fingers on your right hand that creates a greater advantage of long casting distance this reel is a shimano ultegra xtd 5500 holds about 240 yards of line suffix 40 pound proof performance now i'm going to cast one time and this spool is going to be nearly empty watch this So, friends, this pool that carried 240 yards now is about, I don't know, 15, 12 yards left. <laughs> Do the math. I just cast 220 yards of suffix 40. That is a, I don't know. <laughs> In the United States of America, this rod for the first time was used today. December 4th, 2021 is going to be the leading rod a few years back now of any surf caster, especially Long Island, New York. Look at that. It's called Grinder, Coffee Grinder. The reason they call it Coffee Grinder is that the noise that the line makes when it comes off the reel, it sounds like the Coffee Grinder. That's why they call it a grinder. The release mechanism made in England stays right here. You use your left index finger to release the line instead of the right it's amazing it's just very very good hope you enjoy it <laughs> bye okay so i have a new system to present to you folks uh, this one is a tip from a tin dio rod 12 foot long it's a classic only old version with the k guys you can tell right uh, Six, I believe it's about uh, six to 16 ounce uh, weight lure. And the bottom was made by me from another rod. Let me remember. I put this guide, the K guide that matches those guides. And a very long wrapper ends up with a short butt grinder system. Again, for the first time made in South Africa. And the real seat, very large real seat. Um, and the reel uh, this time is a Spinjoy Super Arrow SD35. Uh, it's a very good reel sold uh, in Osaka, Japan. So it doesn't sell in America on eBay, but I order it from Japan if you want one. Uh, it costs really far, it's a very good reel. Uh, it holds about 300 yards. This pool, it's pretty deep, even though it's a long distance design, aluminum spool. Uh, 300 yards of uh, suffix performance 50 pound proof and it's a green color so I am going to try to cast this one the sinker is a five ouncer there you go so let's see what happens 
let's see how much I'm gonna empty from this 300 yards pool uh, using the grinder method. Again, introduced in America for the very first time today, <laughs> on December 4th, 2021. Watch this. Look, you can tell among the cuts of the line, you can see the bottom, the gold color bottom of the spoon. Watch it. Under the sunlight, you can tell. So the spoon was about 300 yards of 50 pound suffix performance. Now it's almost empty. You do the math how far it went. This is amazing. This is the future of surf casting, at least in the United States of America. So whoever is watching this video, believe me, make it yourself they're not gonna sell it for a long time to come you can purchase a pen a battalion 16.2 feet long uh, surf casting rod called grinder coffee grinder from South Africa but the post office the delivery will cost you about $400 and then $200 for the rod that's not worth it so guys make it yourself make it as long as possible make a short handle and then the release mechanism get one on eBay make it yourself you are going to cast from Long Island from somewhere Jones Beach to Portugal I promise you hope you enjoy it